The confusion and the concern about the future of some undocumented immigrants may be cleared up soon by one lawsuit. It's Daniel Ramirez Medina's case in Washington state. Ramirez is a 23-year-old dreamer, a young person brought to America legally as a kid and protected from deportation thanks to an Obama-era policy. Yet Ramirez was arrested by ICE agents and is still being detained by the feds. His attorneys are asking a federal judge to issue a declaratory judgment, essentially saying Ramirez is constitutionally protected from deportation. The lawsuit says, quote, our country promised him that if he was found not to be a threat to public safety or national security, then he would be considered lawfully present in the country and not subject to unconstitutional detention while he played by the rules. This ruling is one to watch because it wouldn't just apply to Ramirez, but also the more than 750,000 people currently protected by the Deferred Action for Childhood Arrivals Program, or DACA. There's no question President Donald Trump is an immigration hardliner, but the president has left that program in place, even as a crackdown has started. It's a very, very tough subject. We are going to deal with DACA with heart. But now Trump's promises seem to be a bit up in the air. The administration has reiterated that anyone in the country, quote, illegally is subject to removal at any time, with a focus on people who have committed crimes. And if anyone in the country illegally really is subject to removal, that would include the dreamers.